Boom. Check it out, man. 5.2 on its way out. Today we're having a look at some of the new cool. They put they finally put tier in, okay, in case you haven't heard. They put tier in on the beta on the PTR so you can come and check it out. Uh, you can check out the sets. I've made videos on what it all looks like, but now you can come check out the actual pieces, how they look on a live character, and you know the stat bonuses and all that shit. Uh, really cool. But today the topic of this video is we're having a look at two new, uh, two sets anyway that are have new animations. The Death Knight one has a very cool little summonable Zandalari guy that we're gonna look at, and then the Shadow Priest one or the the Healing Priest one has changed a bit as well. So we're gonna look at that. And we'll see what it's, you know, give you guys a good look at that and, and talk about why, you know, why this is a cool thing. The fuck? What are you doing? The fuck off me, you fucking. All right, first up is the priest one. I've never seen this before in my life. We're checking it out live for the first time. Let's have a look at it. Here we go. I'm going to get healed up by it. Oh, look at that. That's interesting. So it's not, you know, not the coolest looking thing in the world, but it's definitely going to be something that you're going to notice. And in terms of, you know, the visualization, I think it's it's better than it than I thought it was going to be. It kind of looks like, I mean, it looks like the feathers, to be honest with you. It looks like the, like if if he's throwing a feather at me. Let's see if we can get it. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I like it. I like it a lot. You're going to be seeing that a lot. It's going to be flying out of people. Uh, so if you do see it and looking for it and shit like that, you'll understand what it is. But uh, let's check out the Death Knight one, shall we? I'm very new. But there's a lot more than two. Uh, I apologize for misinformation in the start of the video. And it's going to seem a bit weird, but I'm cutting this in now. Uh, what we have here is the monk set. Okay, you'll see the yellow orb. Uh, basically, it's, it's Windwalker Monk. It says when you use chi generating abilities, you get a chance to drop a little yellow orb. That basically gives you energy when you walk through it. Very similar to the heal, right? So it'll be something that only you could see. And it's just a little yellow orb. You're just going to walk through it and you'll see. Hover over the energy. 36. Move over. And look, it's gone up. Yeah, so that's a really cool thing. I like the way it looks, to be honest with you. It's just a, it's just another orb. You see that shit? Look at that. Nice bright yellow. Look at him. Look at him. How cool is that, man? And we can check out a few other ones. And then we'll wrap it up with the Death Knight at the end. All right. All right, now this one is the hunter. Uh, there's there's a little pet kind of thing for this as well. It is steady shot and cobra shot have a chance to summon a thunder hawk to fight for you the next ten seconds. Uh, it doesn't have a very good chance. We've been here for quite some time and I've only seen one, so hopefully we get lucky here. I don't want to belabor on this too much. I might have to cut the video here and resume it when it does spawn, but it's very cool looking. So let's let's have a look, shall we? Okay, there it is finally. Jesus Christ, that took forever. Yeah, so you see it's just kind of standing back there. It's shooting lightning. Uh, you can't really see the animation too well as it's going through his character right now. But, I mean, it looks good. It looks cool. I like that kind of stuff. I like. I really do like pets, like stuff like that that you could summon in this game. So, uh, that's that. Now, apparently there's some other stuff, so let's let's check it out. Yep, and then the fourth set is Arcane Shot, Multi-Shot, and Aim Shot have a chance to trigger a lightning arrow at the target, dealing 100% weapon damage to... Uh, to the target as nature now this one's not very easy to see oh look there's another one of those fucking things that's hilarious anyway um this one's not very easy to see but you kind of see it right there it's just another arrow it's like a white streak of an arrow right there you see that that's it right there um it looks good you know it's whatever it does a decent amount of damage so that's it for the hunter stuff all right this one is the shaman this is the coolest one in my opinion i didn't even know this one was in the game so this is let me read it exactly what it does. Lightning bolt, chain lightning, and lava beam have a 10% chance to cause a lightning strike at the target. Okay, so let's, let's have a look. I'm going to start with lightning bolt, and you'll see what it looks like. 10% only, so it might take a while here. Oh, got the earth shock proc. I use that. Pop that. Oh, look at that damage. That's crazy damage. Okay, come on, anytime, go, do it. Oh my God, just do it, you stupid dummy. Ugh. Quite typical. Um, as soon as I press record, nothing works. I mean, I literally, I can't cut the. There it is, finally. You see it? It's cool, right? It's like uh, looks like the thunderclap glyph. And now I'm gonna show you. There it is again. 
Now we're going to show you the chain lightning, how it looks. It, I mean, it doesn't really look any different, but you'll see that it can kind of proc. Yep, see how it's just procking randomly? It's pretty fucking cool. Obviously, so it's going to proc a much higher proc chance with each chain lightning hit. Uh, and, and lava beam as well. So that's that's really cool. Now let's actually get some from with lava beam if we can. Okay, just going to pop ascendance and go ape mode. Let's check this out. I don't forget lava beam's been buffed. Let's see if it's any different. Uh, if it even procs. There's one. So it looks a little out of place with lava beam, but uh, still, you know, lava beam's awesome now. It does more damage the more it hits. So that's great. I really love the shaman. I definitely, I'm, well, there we go. Okay. Yeah, I'm done casting lava beam. But anyway, that's it. Uh, let's go on to Death Knight. It's going to be the final one. As I said, I recorded this twice essentially, so it's going to sound a little messed up when I do transition to it. Hopefully, it's not too obtuse for you guys, but I hope you've enjoyed. And this is the Death Knight one. Now, he's targetable. Okay, let's get a good zoom in. I mean, it's it's interesting looking. He dies. Uh, let's, let's wait for another one to come up. But I mean, he looks just like a troll. Obviously, you know, it's it's pretty well done, actually. It looks kind of like some of the newer trolls. So if we can get another one to proc here, I'll show you what it looks like. Uh, oh, oh, there's a gargoyle. That's new, right? Is that new? No, that's not new. Just, uh, just waiting on the procs. Waiting on the procs. Good example of of uh, the proc chance, I think. Yep, just uh, just waiting. Waiting on the procs. Proc of fellow records. There they are. Look at that. So he spawns just like the ghoul does. And he's there. It's right there. Fucking water elemental. But yeah, it looks just like one of the new trolls. I like this. I really do. This is cool stuff. Uh, we'll check out if there's any other if there's any other tier sets that have new animations and stuff like that. But it's cool. You, you'll see, you see this this kind of stuff once a tier. You know what I mean? Obviously, it's it's predominant when everybody has a tier set, and then it kind of goes away. So I felt it was worth a video. But I'm looking forward to it. A lot of really cool stuff happening, especially with the tier sets. As I said, they're live. Flaskator, go get him. Uh, he's by the Valor vendor, from what I understand. And that's that. So enjoy. Enjoy a fucking 5.2. It's going to be sweet. Taking bets on when it's coming out. Two weeks, three weeks, who knows.